My name is Adriana Lyshynska. I'm a graduate of the Masters of Science and Analytics program. Uh, I'm a graduate of the 2013 class. And so before the program, I was uh, student teaching at a local Chicago high school. I was also studying mathematics at the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign um, with a minor in secondary education. I really enjoyed teaching. I really enjoyed math, especially statistics. And uh, so when I found out about the Masters of Science and Analytics program through an email, I knew it was the right program for me. Um, it was a good bridge of uh, mathematics, programming, and business. Um, I didn't want to be in the school setting. I wanted to be more of a business corporate setting, uh, maybe even a startup setting. Um, and so that's, that's where I am now. Citus Analytics is a data science company based off in Chicago. Uh, we're a service and a product company. I work on a smaller team within our department on uh, unstructured data. And so we use a lot of natural language processing. We use a lot of um, data with text, maybe one day photos or videos. Um, but so far, we spend a lot of time uh, helping our service clients uh, understand what's behind their text data. I use the knowledge from the program every single day. All the technical skills that I've learned at the Masters of Science and Analytics program, uh, it gave me a very strong uh, base knowledge to actually then continue learning more tools. So in data science, tools constantly change, and there's always something newer and better. And so keeping up and uh, keeping up with all those tools is something that I was able to learn at, uh, at the program and now currently do here. I will give a shout out to the predictive analytics course and the data, mi data mining course from our professors. That, that Those type of techniques that we learned, uh, I definitely use every day. One of the best advantages of the program are the capstone projects and the client projects they have within the classes. It gives you a great introduction into what real data looks like. A lot of my previous experience has been data from textbooks, and that just doesn't cut it in the real world. There's a lot more messiness out there.